welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Let's take a look at one of our four agreements. Release the need to be right. When you believe something, you assume you're right. You may even destroy relationships in order to defend your position. Let go of the need to defend your position. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 112. Uh, Dow Industrials trading up four. NASDAQ trading up 112. S&P's up 11 and a half. Gold, gold contract down $19.80, trading at 1925 an ounce. We had silver down 34 cents, 22 dollars 67 cents an ounce. Light sweet crew down three bucks, trading at $69.52 a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10 year note down 16 ticks, trading at $112.25. The 30 year off a full point plus two ticks at $127.03 in King Dollar. King, excuse me, folks, King Dollar is trading up 314 ticks at $102.386. The euro is at 109. The yen is trading at 143, and the British pound is at 127 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at it. What do you have? Well, we'll start with the futures again, because we do not have a high volume low out there in the futures, but I want to show you, I'm going to repeat what I just said in that update. What you do have is this, is that you get a few minutes, we got like yeah, you don't have many minutes there to get underneath this number. 4418 uh, is the number, folks, okay? You're at 4420 right now because we do. We took it out. You took it out with light volume. We did uh, 28,000 contracts here versus 45. Um, but you can see intraday here what we did is that the first leg down, that, that's when we got into the price point of, of 4398. And what we had done there is that we did 46,000 contracts, right? And then when we went higher, now, we, we, what you're doing with time in the trade, you're always going against, well, you, when we bounced, you, you're looking at the high and say, okay, what are we going against? So the 4417, which was 28,000, was going against 45. And that's why you had the failure there. Well, we came back down. Okay, now we came back down. You had 33,000. So you can see the contraction of volume there was pretty dramatic. 33 versus 46. Now, that being said, if we get below this 4418, you have a high probability that you will go try to whack the 4402. Because what we do have is that you can see all the volume is still at these two downdrafts. You know, so. It's going to, you know, we, the volatility bottom line has been much slower. We, we're in summer trading, bottom line, you know, uh, we've had a high or low today of uh, 30 S&P points. When 30 S&P points uh, a few weeks ago, you know, we, we could get like in a, in a heartbeat. But bottom, we'll see where the baby shakes out. We go into the um, NQs. The NQs are exact. Well, yeah. Now, no, let's do the SPY, because the SPY, what you have with the SPY out here, it looks like the SPY, you're going to have a rejection of lower price out here today. You're going to have lighter volume. You got down to 433.60. You're at 436. You can see the contraction of volume. It's pretty dramatic. 46 million shares. That 46 million was going against 95. That's saying that, hey, guess what, man? The, the high is game once again, which is... Pretty wild, but that's that's how this is reading right now. I mean, unless we just fall apart at the close, but that's how this is reading. We go to the gold contract. That gold contract, you know, it's tricky, but the bottom line is that you have two separate ABC structures on the way down. You know, the first one that you have is a 1902. The second one is 1875. You know, you're down $19.80 out here today, and that that, you know, bottom line, it's not that bad with the dollar being up 300 ticks. The 300 ticks on the dollar, we'll go through that in a second, you know, isn't putting pressure on the uh, S&P, which is unusual, but the bottom line, it isn't. You can see that, yeah, you have a contraction of volume here, but that being said, this thing wants those bars down there where we came off the last low. So the last, the last low in this contract is 18, is 19, yeah, 1846. The next low after that is the 1848, and you know, the, the bar where the strength started 
1867. So my take is that, that in the, that's the bottom of the bar, the top of the bar is 1908. So that's saying to me, that's the bar that we're going to trade into. Notes and bonds. Now, the note and bond market, bottom line, you're pulling back today in the 10. That being said, the pullback on the 10 is with light volume. You know, so this is going to be a rejection of lower price once again. Well, it hasn't rejected it yet. We're at 110. We're at 112.24. And the rejection, we got to 112.21. You like, you like the bottom seat, like, well, you like to see it higher than that. But the bottom line is that you have a huge contraction of volume. We have 1.2 1 1 million contracts going into 1.7 as well as 1.9. Oil. Let's get to the oil market. Oil wants a lot lower price, man. That's the bottom line. I mean, they, they're trying to keep this thing up, but everything they try to do, they just can't get done. You know, this thing, now we have, you got one, uh, one, two, three. You got three higher, lower highs. Let me make sure of this. One, two, three. Yeah, you got three lower highs right at this point. You only got one lower low because what happens is that I can't start all the way back because I got to start at the high. Yeah, big volume coming in. My take is that what you're going to see here is that you are going to go down to the bottom of that, that consolidation. And if we get over to the dollar, you can see what that's happening with the dollar. This dollar, um, what it what came out, what it did today is that it got down to the price point of 101.921, and bottom line, it rejected it. You know, uh, we're uh, at 102, 387. Yeah, 387. Uh, now, the market hasn't reacted to that today, you know, because no normally would you, you get something like that, you have that S&P go south like ASAP, but it hasn't reacted to it. Some of the higher volume equities, well, no, no, let's go through silver. We take a look at the silver market. Inside of the silver market, what you have? Silver hit 2251 today. You know, I, I did these numbers. These are an ABC down, too, somewhere into the 2130 uh, area. Stay right there, folks. Come right back with our man, Mr. Tim Ord. Dow. Dow Industrials right now trading down six. NASDAQ is up 109. S&P's are up 11.5. We'll come right back.